Hi everybody, Scott Vince here, aka the Redhead Rebel, and um, I mentioned this in my book, but I want to talk about four must-have business books plus one, and I'll explain in a second. So, one of the great books that I read was Good to Great by Jim Collins, and this tells you what separates great businesses from good ones. It has lots of facts, it has lots of uh, great information and it's an awesome book must have the next one on the docket would be uh, tribal leadership you know essentially all groups of people have little tribes and within those tribes you have different attitudes and it kind of helps you to how to evolve people so they move towards the uh, we're great or life's great tribe rather than the apathetic tribe, uh, so to speak, or the life sucks tribe. The next book that really helped me was Peak by uh, Chip Conley, uh, great, where great companies get their mojo from Maslow, which first is you got to meet the basic needs of your customers, your partners, your employees, and your investors. Um, and then you need to find unrecognized needs that they may have and then um, move up the Maslow's Pyramid and, and Chip breaks that down awesome. Uh, the next thing is an example of those books in action with Tony Shea's Delivering Happiness and what all took place at Zappos and continues to take, zap, take place at Zappos with a great work culture. And it's a great example of the things good to great, tribal leadership, and peak come from. And the last book, of course, is my book, Principles of Fortune. And the feedback I've got is, and why I mention this, is those four books are books when we were growing Real Truck and really started to get the culture rocking. Those were must-read books for everybody in the organization. Um, after I sold Real Truck, I wrote this book on... Uh, how Real Truck went to uh, from a basement to uh, eventually going well over 100 million in sales, and how we bet everything on culture. This book, Principles of Fortune, that I wrote, talks about the Real Truck story, but it talks about how to actually create a winning culture, actions to take, questions to ask, and um, I hope you uh, check out those four books plus this one. And uh, I thought I wanted to kind of get a video out. I talk about this in the book, but obviously if you don't have the book, um, you wouldn't know that. So, and I want to also share how other people that have bought the book said, uh, have shared with me how it kind of ties in and actually is a, uh, for them, a how-to guide on how to deliver more to customers, partners, or employees, and so forth. So, uh, thanks for tuning in. And if you're watching this video, you know, like the page, subscribe. Um, and if you've read the book, uh, please share how it's helped you uh, and help all those other redhead rebels, those underdogs, those people, the rest of us, the rest of us entrepreneurs trying to uh, build, grow, and improve. So until next time, smile.